friends, Amanda here from Fun Hands on Learning. Today we're going to look at this Math Patterns Activity Book. In this book, students are going to work on picture patterns and number patterns. Let's turn to the first page. Okay, at the top here we have circle, fair, circle, fair, what comes next? Circle, so students can use a dry erase marker to mark their answer. Let's take a look at the next pattern. Bear, heart, heart, bear, next one would be heart. Every other page, one page is pictures, and the next page is numbers. Let's take a look at the first numbers page. Five, six, seven, what comes next? Eight. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, what comes next? Eighteen. Now we can make this book a little bit more interactive by using some of these math tools that I have here with me. This is a movable hundred chart. Students can use the pieces from this chart to mark their answers. Five, six, seven, what comes next? They can take the number eight and place it on their book. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, what comes next? We can find eighteen and place it on our book. Now let's look at the next page. Let's make these patterns a little bit more interactive. Here I have bears and I have shape buttons. So let's build the same pattern. We need bear, bear. So let's get bear, bear. And then we need hexagon, hexagon. So we're going to do hexagon, hexagon. I don't have the same colors, but we can still make the same pattern. Bear, bear, hexagon, hexagon, what will come next? What will come next would be another bear, because we would have bear, bear, and then hexagon, hexagon, and our pattern would continue. Now, after we have figured out what will come next, let's mark our answer. So, bear, bear, hexagon, hexagon, bear, bear. So, we need a bear. Okay, let's take a look at the bottom pattern. We have bear, then we have heart, then we have another bear, then we have another heart. So our pattern is bear, heart, bear, heart. Bear, heart, bear, heart, what comes next? What comes next is bear. Let's take a look at the next page. Here we have more numbers. The numbers are going to work all the way up through 100. So you're doing single patterns to 100. 87, 88, 89, what comes next? 90. You could also have your students build their answer with other number manipulatives like magnetic numbers or puzzle numbers. So here I'm going to build 90 with my magnetic letters. 9, 0. My answer is 90. All right, so let's look at the next pattern. 44, 45, 46, what comes next? We know it's 47. And then I have my students build 47. Here I'm going to use puzzle numbers. So let's build 47. So there you have it. I hope your students enjoy working on all the different patterns in this fun math pattern activity book and we will see you in the next video happy learning bye